Hi, my name is Lizzie, and today I'm going to walk you through my spring dapper day Disneyland outing outfit. James and I at Disney bounded as Celia and Mike Wazowski from Monsters Inc. And we also had our friend Brizzy Voices be our Sully. And our dapper trio always slays. A couple of you guys were asking me if I was going to make a video about my outfit, and honestly, I wasn't planning on it. But since you asked, here it is. So starting off with the main article of clothing, which was my dress. Um, I got this green flapper sequin fringy dress uh, from Amazon, actually, and it's like a really nice looking dress. I think it is really pretty. I don't think it fits me perfectly, but it fits me well enough, and I could just like have it tailored on the shoulders a little bit, and it would be great. And I'm definitely gonna wear this multiple times because I have weird occasions that I can wear flapper dresses to. So I'm very happy with this purchase. And on to my accessories. So since Celia is purple, I wanted to incorporate the most purple that I could without being too over the top and costumey, so I got the these purple opera gloves from Amazon Shocker. And then I got this mint green seafoam feather boa. Oh wait, no, I got this from Etsy. So not everything is from Amazon because she has like this feathery, fluffy fur around her neck that is a slightly different green from the dress. It's kind of like a blue green. So I found this was the closest color I could find. I really like this color. You could always tell where I had been at Dapper Day because it sheds everywhere. If I had been kidnapped while wearing this, I'm sure anyone would be able to track me down because I was leaving a trail literally everywhere. You see what I mean? This just fell off just now. Now moving on to my fascinator. I got this from Amazon. I knew I had to incorporate snakes into the outfit somewhere because her hair snakes are such an iconic, probably the most iconic part of her look. So I got this purple fascinator on Amazon. Um, it had like these feathers sticking out of it before. Um, and I plucked those off, I plucked those feathers out, and I ordered just like a pack of toy snakes on Amazon. I spray painted the snakes purple, and then I hot glued them into the hat. So when I wear it, it's just like snakes are in my hair. A much smaller touch that probably no one else noticed was that I got these purple earrings um, that kind of reminded me of like the snake's rattles, which kind of look like Celia's earrings. So it was such a small, touch, but like I knew it was there, so I was really happy about it. And my final accessory was this faux snake skin purse that I got from Amazon. Once again, I just wanted to work the most snake things I could into the outfit, and I needed a purse, so I got this one, and it was great, and it held everything, and it, uh, yeah, it matched, it was fine, yeah. It's a purse, it's snakes, you get it. For my shoes, I just wore some black flats that I had because as dapper days go on, I care less and less about my shoes because I know if I get some cute shoes or like heels, I will not wear them. I will wear them for maybe five minutes. So I'm either going to wear tennis shoes or flats from now on. From now on. It's just a personal choice because I never wear heels, so why would I on Dapper Day? I am not fit for that life. I'm not ready for that. I cannot handle it. Anyways, that's my whole outfit for Dapper Day. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure you go check out James's video where he breaks down his Mike Wazowski Disney bound. Go check out all of our pictures on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. Instagram is the platform I am the most active on, so if you like me here, you'll like me on other platforms, probably in picture form, and follow me on Twitter if you want. So that's all I've got. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!